Sweden and, and the Swedish government uh, uh, put, sets a, a very high priority on uh, climate financing. We see that we really need to uh, higher the ambitions. Uh, we have all been uh, affected by the, the climate change and uh, especially the most vulnerable countries and municipalities and uh, especially women and children are affected by climate change. So we need to uh, higher the ambitions and we need to put focus on financing uh, and we need to cooperate and have collaboration with the, the local level and we do that together with uh, CEDA. We, had a good, we have a good partner in CEDA and they're doing a good job and we need to continue uh, and one important thing is uh, the, the fact that uh, uh, we have engagement on the local level and, and uh, a decentralized way of uh, trickling down the money at that, so they reach the, the people that are also sitting uh, on the negotiation table, especially women. Uh, I think it's very important to have a rights-based approach and also uh, as I said, the decentralized uh, uh, way and that it comes from from the people being most affected and from the countries and municipality that need to that that see the needs and and have the climate change really in front of their eyes. So if we want the the the, the money and the financial flows to be really effective, we need to have. Uh, local engagement and a rights-based uh, approach and, and gender equity and also a decentralized system for, for uh, climate financing.